The dawn of New Age sports is upon us, and it's filled with action now. Now Magazine for Television. Hi, and welcome to Action Now Magazine for Television. I'm D. David Morin, and for the next half an hour, we're going to be taking a look at the most radical, progressive sports and personnel of modern film footage that'll blow you away. Things happen fast in the world of Action Now, so have a seat and tune in. You won't want to miss a second. Let's go to action now. Just outside San Luis Obispo, California, there's a secret spot that's perfect. The giant sand dunes that rise out of Morro Bay offer a natural playground that wait to be tapped. The playground is for sandboarding. This is Jack Smith. A local here in Los Osos, Jack has taken his surfing ability on water and snow and brought it to the dunes. Using a board originally designed for the snow, Jack discovered that by applying surfboard wax to the bottom of his snowboard, he actually can surf on sand. Like skiing, bindings are needed to keep Jack's feet on the board. His A-Team model comes with bindings on it, a large elastic strap that goes over each foot. Some even use surf leashes as part of the system. Dropping in on the sand dune is like surfing down a wave, skiing down a mountain, or skateboarding down a freshly paved hill. The 45 degree slope with scattered pucker bushes provide a natural slalom course down the dune. An experienced sandboarder, Jack carves this run with ease. Jack has the dunes wired at Los Osos, and every session includes getting some air. His partner in fun, Gary Fluitt, another local sandboarder, has got it wired too. But like most sports, for the beginner, it's not as easy as it looks. Okay, you try it. Gary's style is totally fluid. Like skiing in deep powder, Gary keeps shifting his edges by unweighting for each turn. up is well worth it. The whole face just waiting for new lines to be drawn. skateboarders are a clan unto themselves. Some of the best include Eric Gresham, Steve Hirsch, Neil Blender, and David Z. Pool riding styles differ from skater to skater. David Z works the pipeline pool like a ramp skating back and forth with a lot of tricks above coping. A 
Another style is to use the whole pool area. Steve Alba is utilizing every inch of the Kami pool with surf-like moves to carve up and down these permanent vertical waves of concrete. The safety equipment used today is the result of years of development. Lightweight helmets, wrist guards, knee pads, gloves, elbow pads, and padded shorts are all used for protection. New wheels and trucks have opened the door to new age skating. And the protective gear works. Look at these Wilsons. Even the cameraman could use some protection. Look out, Don! The tricks are numerous. A board slide, a tail tap stall, a rock and roll, a pogo rock and roll, and a pogo rock and roll with a slight stall. A favorite is backside airs. Here's a string of them. Every one has a little different style, but the goal is the same, getting bionic. Watch Neil Blender come out over the coping and still manage to pull it back in for re-entry. After aerials were mastered, the hand plan evolved. Brad Bowman, then Mickey Alba show us how it's done. Check out this fully extended hand plant by Neil Blender that he makes. Still, you can't beat the feeling of pulling off a high-speed board slide nine blocks long. Bowman, show us how it's done in style. We'll be back with more action now after this.